Hey guys, thanks for joining me. I've got the uh, radio powered back up again. Everybody that watched the uh, video on the 5-inch electrodynamic loudspeaker and the feedback that everyone shared is uh, most welcomed. Anyway, I'm tuned in to a uh, station 1440 AM on the dial, so 1440 kilohertz. This radio is not aligned, but just looking at various schematics that I have for reference, somewhere around uh, 462 to 456 maybe for the IF. I'm going to just use my uh, Sony receiver and uh, see if we can pick up the IF real quick and just see where we're at. We'll start here around 465 or so. I'm going to just work my way down 1 kilohertz. So I know the receiver is out of alignment. Looks like around uh, 439 kilohertz for the uh, IF. So let's take uh, 439 and add that back to the uh, 1440. We'll tune over to the oscillator and uh, see if we pick that up. So 1879. And there's our uh, CW carrier unmodulated for the uh, local oscillator. So definitely a indicator that the IFs are not adjusted correctly. Uh, definitely uh, low. Again, I don't know the precise IF frequency these things were designed for, but we'll shoot somewhere around 456 to 460. Bring it up from the uh, 439 to 440 kilohertz that they're set at today when I get to that point. Just wanted to uh, share that again. The uh, little Sony receiver comes in handy for validating the uh, local oscillator and the IFs at times. Let me go back down to the uh, IF frequency. Alrighty folks, I'm going to get busy uh, cleaning up some of the electrical and before I mount the uh, loudspeaker back on the chassis itself, I'm going to take time to uh, clean up some of the crud as well on the uh, top side and then I'll get into the alignment, probably just do that offline. If I find anything uh, major, I'll share it with you guys. Thanks for watching.